everyone, Michelle Fix It. Today is August 7th, 2023. I am not. Uh, this is the definition of multitasking. <laughs> My children are taking a spirited bath and I have to do dishes. I can see them in the mirror, but you can't see them. We've had another long, long day. So, set up. You hear them. Okay, what happens? Okay, you guys have to be careful. You're taking a bath. Need these subtle cats. Okay. Two inches of water in there, and he still finds ways to injure himself. You okay, buddy? You okay? Yeah. You were just trying really hard to injure yourself. Here, why don't you play with this? Okay, Izzy. No, let's not stand in the bathtub. You guys play. Here, why don't you play with this with water? Like dump it on, just fill it up and dump it out. Pausing you guys splash. to make sure that I get it where you guys can't see them. Okay, so we're back. I also have a super excited news. Well, and this is uh, the status of the dinosaur. I keep putting it on its side and Izzy keeps like moving it. So that will live right there. Uh, I found George Sean's phone. Turns out that it was in Izzy's. Um, Izzy's back. So the one I couldn't find it in Manassas or Georgetown, or Patterson, or any of the places because it was in Isabel's back. Because, you know, why not? Or is uh, Poppy Shaver in the bowls? I don't, I don't know. Because, like, I'm just the one that is here to uh, do tidies. That's what I do. Even though, ironically, I'm the one that doesn't like to clean. So, I attempted, I'm like... I'm watching Charlie's at the back. Okay. I attempted two times to do a video about something that was incredibly frustrating, which is someone complaining about how they don't know what to do with their life, and they're like, this is so goofy, and they don't know what they're doing, and blah, 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 blah. I'm like, okay, well, what, what are your goals? What are your goals? Long term, short term? Are you hobbies? What do you like to do? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, why don't you try? I don't know. I just don't care anymore. It's like, okay, we have to find something that you care about, and you have to have a goal that you're chasing. And it's very frustrating as someone that, like, literally finds ways to be happy with everything. Anything that I was far as always messing with them, I don't care. So, I sent all these articles to myself about, like, how to find a hobby, blah, 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 blah. And it's like, you need to find a hobby that sparks creativity. You need to find a hobby that will generate income. You need to find a hobby that expands your knowledge base. And it's like, there you go. Like, what are you interested in? You're interested in history? Okay, start reading. Start going to historical sites. There's historical sites everywhere. It's just a matter of, like, looking them up. It's not that hard. And I know what I'm interested in, and you know, what I like. And it's very frustrating to try to like coax someone into being a happy person when they just don't want to be. It's like, come on, you're stagnating. And I see that like everywhere, everyone is stagnating. And it's like, wake up. Everybody keeps talking about this like woke thing. It's like, no, wake up and look around and be like, is this the life I want to live? Am I happy with my existence? Am I stressed out? What am I stressed out about? Can I do the things to fix my stresses? Like, I am thoroughly enjoying making the YouTube videos and documenting all this fun stuff with my children. But I'm also getting very antsy. I was not designed to be a domestic cat. Okay? This, this is not my preferred existence. I, would be good with this like one day a week, once every two weeks, once every, month, once every three weeks, every single day. I love my children, but like every single day, not fun. 
I want to be building and creating things. I want to be mentally stimulated with problems and houses and creative ways to correct Mommy. them or researching to find out Make how to correct them. I see, I can see you guys back there. I'm glad you guys are burning off a little bit of energy because you both need to go to bed soon. I mean, I'm enjoying what I'm doing, but I require more stimulus. It's not that I don't love my children because I do. Okay, you guys have to like calm down and be a little bit safer. The slippy slidey stuff that you guys are trying to do is not really your great. Yeah, the big bunny. Charlie, I see you. You need to sit down, buddy. Can you sit down with Sissy? <clears throat> so like, I can't wait to get back to Baltimore. Well, I'm sitting down because I'm too big. I got two down houses over there. And I'm gonna start working on it. Set up my play. I already have a playroom set up in Georgetown. I know that the grass is gonna be another stupid thing to mow. I still haven't played to my grass seed. I have lots of stuff to do. And like for me, those are things that need to happen. And like, I got you. If I if everything was perfect in my life, which it has been before, mm -hmm. I established acres mm -hmm. and I established a pecking order and I established accountability mm -hmm. chains and I set up my office <laughs> lobby area one day for like half an hour, an hour, and I had nothing to do. So you know what I did? I enrolled in school. Because I was like, yeah, might as well finish, you know, do that, finish up that degree that I started at some point. Um, so, I mean, for me, I know what to do. And I get very frustrated when I offer up advice. Because some people just need a cheat person. They need a person who's going to give them life cheats. You know, everybody talks about life hacks. No, they're life cheats. Somebody, somebody figured out the system. There's a the cheat person for it. There you go. Like, I love that kind of stuff. So, no. that's my random complaining. Just because I want people to live their best lives. And if your best life is being a, a garbage truck guy, because you love cleaning stuff up, and you love driving the truck, and honking the car, and jumping out, and feeling like you're saving the city from garbage. How cool for you! Live your best life! If you're not loving your job, you're spending 8, 10, 12 hours of your day on purpose grumpy. I love working on the houses. I love working with my children. I love teaching my children. You know the only thing I don't love? Spending time with people that mess up the houses and try to mess up my children by doing inappropriate things around them. So, you know what? That was cool. I'm going to run with that. I want to check it. Because then, I get to be the one that comes in to start the house and says, hey, breach contract. You better fix it. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to charge you for it. And then, like my houses will actually have people that love them and care about them like I do. Mom, and then maybe that'll be that? betterment for the family because they'll learn how to work together. Uh, yes, see, I see you guys. I see. You are creatively putting the little container that I gave you in your mouth to thrust it across the bathroom. And, and you're entertaining your brother. It bounces so off and it comes in the water. I see. I see. <laughs> so, you know, people always mess up. I try to be a good cat. I try to do what I'm supposed to do. And I keep getting put in situations where I have to be grumpy to people. <laughs> I don't like it. Because I literally have, like, so many reasons to be grateful and happy with my life. You know what? One of the big ones is laughing his butt off right now. And the other big one, another big one, is uh, making him laugh his butt off. And the first big one thinks that I'm a mean person. And, you know, if I'm, if I'm the bad guy in their, in their life, there's a lot worse people than me, so that's fine. I'll, I'll do that. Not the bad guy, but if that's supposed to be what I am, because I like read up on parental alienation and like evidently some abusive people um, continue abuse, which I knew, I just didn't know there was a term for it. So it's like, oh yeah, we're going to continue to be abusive by means of uh, brainwashing children and stuff like that. So that's cool. That's super cool. I'm a very patient person. My child is alive and well. Well, alive and wellish. And uh, they will, you know, forever. Hey, mommy, you lost my balls. What, baby? You lost my balls. Okay, hold on. I'll grab it. Oh, 
Okay, so this is not going to throw stuff out of the bathtub, dude. No, sir. Thank and you, Lizzie, you're welcome. You can add some more water because mm -hmm. evidently the tub's slowly leaking. Because now you guys don't have much water. Only like two inches of water. <laughs> That was Charlie's last cat half a lot. I'm hoping that I'll be able to get him to sleep after I feed him. I should have fed them again. We've had a weird... Charlie! Buddy! Buddy, I saw that. Why did you do that? Why did you wipe out like that, buddy? Oh, my goodness. Come here. You try to be a slip and slide and slide. Or do you want to stay? I know he's a baby, so for him, this is like the worst thing he's ever had. He's like, oh my goodness, I really hurt myself. Are you okay, buddy? Do you want to stay or do you want to get out? Do you want to stay? And you want a dad dad? Well, a dad dad is like a long, long way away. Do you want me to get you out? Do you want out? They got too cold to get out. Do you want to play with this? You want to we play have with a that? bottle? Uh, mm, hold on. Here, you can have a you can have a bubba cup, and you can dump water and stuff, and then I'll rinse another one out for you. Oh, and we do have this. Bottle. We have this bottle. Okay, buddy, throwing stuff out of the tub is not going to be where it's at, okay? But you guys can play with stuff in the tub, but not throw stuff out of the tub. He just keeps like trying to skateboard on the tub. Oh, ho, ho, you got the top off of it, buddy. And again, I can wash dishes and see them at the same time. You guys just can. <laughs> Eight inches. Eight inches. I told the Baba. Eight ounces. Eight ounces. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know. There are so many people that I think are just like stagnating in life. They just need direction. If I'm more than willing to help, just give me direction. Because like, I mean, I don't know. Failure was not an option for me. I had a baby that was dependent on me, and then I had two babies that depended on me, and I have three babies that depended on me. And man, oh man, do they get more complicated and more complex as they get right out. The big ones get to help with the little ones. Yes, I do love that feature of my spreading out of children. Because I did think I was one and done. I used to say that all the time, one and done, one and done, one and done. And if I really was one and done, my one would be graduating from high school next year. I'm turning 18 this year, which is so weird. 18? Yeah, it's just going to be 18 this year. And my goal to her when she turned 18 was that, like, she would have already had a car. Like, as soon as she was able to get her license, she would have had a car with me to get her learner's permit as soon as that was available. I would have given her, like, mommy's version of Poppy's driving school because that served me very, very well, even though it was scary at the time. Like, I think he was really proud of himself in that video for the semi. Just, like, blew a tire, and I just, like, handled it very, very well, and he just kind of, like, he didn't even freak out or anything. He's like, nope, my daughter knows what to do. But then, like, every now and then, he acts like I'm going to hit somebody, or somebody's going to hit me. And then I get frustrated. I'm like, I literally had a tire blow out right in front of me. And, like, you didn't bat an eyelash because you knew I knew what I was doing. But, like, it's all these silly things. You act like I'm silly. Happened. Yes, you are silly. And Charlie's so... Ah! What did Oh, the top. Yeah. Okay, don't throw the things at me. You're going to get him to start throwing the top outside of the tub again. Please don't do that. If you guys haven't realized my cool method, I use like the hottest water and then I rinse off all the oil because it'll go down the drain. And I just make sure you can it. Okay, Charlie, you cannot keep throwing yourself. Buddy, I know you think it's fun to throw yourself. Charlie, you can't throw yourself.
yourself in the bathtub. You do it on the floor and it doesn't work well. And if you're in the bathtub, you slip. Do you want out? Do you want to stay in or do you want out? You want out? Are you done? You're not done. Okay. He's like, I'm too cool to be done. Okay, Izzy, you have to help him not. Oh, goodness. You throw stuff at me. Okay, all right. Don't, no. Don't throw stuff. Did I hurt your feelings because I hit him with my hand? Buddy. Look, look, look. Look what you can do, buddy. Look. You fill up the bottle with the water. Look at this. And then you pour it on Sissy. It's funny. Ha, 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 ha. And then we put the water. Yeah, see? Look, here. And you go. I see. Don't mess up Poppy's little poofy thing, okay? This is Poppy's. I believe so. It's not mine, and it magic its way into the bathroom, so I believe it's his. So maybe, just maybe, we turn the baby into a little baby burrito, and like, I will give you some nummy bites, and then, and then you will come nummy bites. You want? Oh, come on. There's that bottle you threw out. Yeah, I know. I don't have enough hands to turn them off at the same time. Okay. <coughs> Hold on. You want to say hi to the people? Because you've been screaming and they need to see that you're not like dying. <laughs> you see the people? You see the people say, I was jumping and trying to throw myself in the bathtub. And then I fell and then my feelings were hurt. And then I would scream at the top of my lungs. And now I'm mad at Mama because Mama took me out of the bathtub. Because I was only hurting myself enough to scream. 
Just enough to scream. That's it. <laughs> no, he's a Mickey baby. Um, so I guess this no, you are not getting back in there, sir. No. Oh, come on. <laughs> he says no. I wanna get back in. I liked it. I liked it. Just like I like trying to like smushes myself. Yeah, they're super cute, but they require a lot of work. Oh, you flipped the camera? You flipped the camera? Did you think that was fun? Huh? <laughs> All right. Well, this is the end of the video. As he tries to get back in the bathroom. Bye.